Hello, thank you for coming. And in order for Post-Traumatic Stress Disorder Awareness Month, I wanted to do a little overview on what post-traumatic stress disorder is. Post-traumatic stress disorder is a mental condition that's triggered by a terrifying event, either experiencing it or witnessing it. Symptoms may include flashbacks, nightmares, and severe anxiety, as well as uncontrollable thoughts about the event. Most people who go through traumatic events may have temporary difficulty adjusting and coping, but with time and good self-care, they usually get better. If the symptoms get worse, last for months or even years, and interfere with your day-to-day -day functioning, you may have PTSD. Getting effective treatment <clears throat> after PTSD symptoms develop can be critical to reduce symptoms and improve function. Symptoms of PTSD, post-traumatic stress disorder symptoms, may start within one month of a traumatic event, but sometimes symptoms may not appear until years after the event. These symptoms cause significant problems in, a, in social or work situations and in relationships. They can also interfere with your ability to go about your normal daily task. PTSD symptoms are generally grouped into four types, intrusive memories, avoidance, negative changes in thinking and mood, and changing in the physical and emotional reactions. Symptoms can vary over time, vary from person to person. Intrusive memories, symptoms of intrusive memories may include recurrent, unwanted, distressing memories of the traumatic event, reliving the traumatic event as if it was happening again, flashbacks, upsetting dreams or nightmares about the traumatic event, severe emotional distress or physical reactions to something that reminds you of the traumatic event, avoidance, sometimes avoidance may include trying to avoid thinking or talking about the traumatic event, avoiding places, activities, or people that remind you of what happened, negative changes in thinking and in, in thinking and mood, negative thoughts about yourself, other people, or the world, hopelessness about the future, memory problems, including not remembering important aspects or of the traumatic event, difficulty maintaining close relationships, feeling detached from family and friends, lack of interest in activities you once enjoyed, difficulty experiencing positive emotions, feeling emotionally numb, changing changes in physical and emotional reactions, being easily startled or frightened, always being on guard for danger, self-destructive behavior such as drinking too much or driving too fast, trouble sleeping, trouble concentrating, irritability, angry outbursts or aggressive behavior, overwhelming guilt or shame. For children six years old or younger, signs and symptoms may also include reenacting the traumatic event or aspects of the traumatic event through play, frightening dreams that may or may not include aspects of the traumatic event. PTSD symptoms can vary in intensity over time. You may have more PTSD symptoms when you're stressed in general or when you come across reminders of what you went through. For example, you may hear a car backfire and relive combat experiences, or you may see a report on the news about sexual assault and feel overcome by memories of your own assault. If you have disturbing thoughts and feelings about traumatic events, for more than a month, if they're severe or if you fail, you have, if you fail, you're having trouble getting your life back under control, talk to your doctor or your mental health professional. Getting treatment as soon as possible can help prevent PTSD symptoms from getting worse. If you have any suicidal thoughts, please reach out as soon as possible. The number is 1-800-273-TALK. 
1-800-273-8255. Once you get emergency help, if you think you may hurt yourself or someone else, call 911 or your local emergency room. Again, the number for the suicide hotline is 1-800-273-TALK or 1-800-273-8255. Just wanted to give you some information as it is uh, Post-Traumatic Stress Disorder Awareness Month and I want you guys to be aware of symptoms because some people don't realize they have it and then they have it. Um, So I just want you guys to be aware. Um, Thank you for watching and have a great day.